Yeah. Assalamu alaikum and hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sharif. So, the reason why you are watching this video is because you want to know what happened during the first year of doing computer science degree. Well, you're in luck because I'm going to tell you what happened to me. Yeah. So, a little bit of background. So, I studied computer science in University of Edinburgh and I just finished my first year so still fresh in my mind what happened I'm going to tell you what happened and what are my obstacles are and my hardships during my first year degree let's go so during my first semester I took three courses introduction to computation uh, introduction to linear algebra and also fundamentals in algebra and calculus so amongst these three the easiest one was Fundamentals of Algebra and Calculus because it's basically A-levels but a little bit harder but not that hard. The second one was Introduction to Linear Algebra, my least favorite subject because I'm not into math but I barely passed, not really barely passed, I got like 80 which is good. And the third one was the Introduction to Computation which is my main. Yeah. So Introduction to Computation um, divided to two parts, which is the first one was about functional programming, which is pretty new to me at least. I never heard of functional programming, programming language called Haskell, which is pretty fun. And the lecture was super fun too, and really funny though. And the second part of the course was about logic, where we learned about computational logic. And yeah, that one is pretty much, I will not say boring, but uh, there's a lot of stuff to understand. And yeah, that's pretty much what I did during the first semester. So on the second semester, I took also three subjects. The first one was Introduction to Object-Oriented Programming, which is the best one. The second one was um, Calculus and its Applications. And the third one was uh, Logic 1. Logic 1 was pretty easy. It's about just um, derivations and stuff. Um, calculus and, and its Applications, of course, my least favorite subject, which is math. Uh, kind of hard but manageable and the third one was introduction to object-oriented programming which is super fun so the language which we use in studying object-oriented was java the courses teaches about everything you need to know about object-oriented programming and yeah it was pretty fun i like it we don't have finals for oop but we did have assignment and we need to create a, a library for a library like books and stuff which is pretty fun and pretty dope makes you to apply what you learn in during the course and during the mid course we did a game called Fox and Hound which is that's also pretty fun you can check it out Fox and Hound game is basically like chess but with less pieces and different rules it's a board game so yeah so that's what I did during my first year well apparently that is a question that been lingering with with me when I first starting out my my first year where I'm pretty scared that I cannot cope to be honest I don't have any background in computer science where during my A levels, I did physics, chemistry, and math, which is none of that have any computer science related things. And during my high school, my primary school, I don't have any exposure in coding. I have some, but not much. So it's pretty scary at first. So at one day, during my very first lecture, uh, during my introduction to computation. What? So during my first lecture, uh, our lecturer ask the, the audiences that those who doesn't have any background raise up your hand and apparently half of us doesn't have any experience so if you have the will the passion to learn in computer programming ugh, in computer science then that's all you need to have you don't need to have a background but you have the will the passion to learn computer science um i think it's not that hard yeah i think it's not that hard to be honest i have friends that also struggles in understanding the concepts and how to code and stuff so in the degrees in the courses we have a lot of you know support like from our peers there's this thing like online questionnaires where we can ask a platform where you can ask questions and the lecturers tutor will answer your questions we also have labs tutorials all of stuff that pretty much can help you with understanding the course and also we have like intern the internet, the holy grail of computer science people. We have Stack Overflow, what do you got? Um, yep, pretty much everything. You can just Google it out. And trust me, if you don't do all the tutorials, your labs, your homeworks, it's hard. Just do everything that the lecturers give to you gave to you. Don't go party all day long. You know, you have something to do. You have a degree to get. Trust me, if you do all those things, you'll be pretty much good to go. It's not that hard. Just do your labs tutorials and also homeworks 
please. So basically any tips that I want to give to you guys is just do it. If you like it, you like the course, you like computer science, then just go. Or anything else, never it. Law, literature, math, engineering, just go for it. Don't be scared. Those just obstacles. So anyway, I hope that answers your a lot of your questions about what happened during my first year in, in computer science. And if you do have any questions, feel free to ask. Comment down below. Don't be scared. And if you like my content, subscribe. Like it. <coughs> Alright guys, see you guys again. Assalamualaikum. Bye-bye.